Hi there, Cheryl from Stage 4 Journey. Um, I'm coming to you just to uh, let you know that we didn't forget about you all. Um, we had a little bit of an issue with the July 4th videos that Chris uh, taped and uh, was trying to upload and some computer problems that and just um, He's really having a hard time right now with the Lyme's treatment and the Keytruda and just, he's just totally wiped out. Um, he's been having some memory issues again and a lot of that's related to the fatigue and um, just he hasn't been able to eat a whole lot and uh, so it's it's been really tough on him. And then the computer problems on top of everything else. Um, he's, he's really having having a tough time and he had the video uploaded and if anyone saw it was like the first three minutes and the rest of it was black and I we don't know what happened. Um, so the computer won on that one. <laughs> So he's working on that, trying to work on that, um, but right now he's probably sleeping close to 14 to 16 hours a day, and when he is up, he just feels terrible. So um, we go on Wednesday, two more days. Um, today is Monday, July 10th. Um, in two days, he's scheduled for his next Keytruda infusion. Um, fingers crossed. He went for his lab work today to see if um, everything's okay. So we'll find out from that. I'm kind of worried about that just because he hasn't been eating and um, has been feeling really bad. Um, so I'm kind of concerned about what his lab work's going to show. But... Um, He's, he's fighting. He told me this evening, he said, it's not going to get me. I'm just going to keep on fighting. So he's uh, having some up and down days, some rough days. And of course, it's hard on me too, um, to, as a caregiver, to see that and watch and um, just try to have a an open mind and open heart and um, I call it the peaceful presence just supporting him lifting him up and um, holding him up some days some days quite literally um, so we're still in this he's still fighting and uh, we will hopefully upload the July 4th video real soon um, fingers crossed, his technology assistant might be able to figure it out. I don't know, folks. So, again, thank you so much for all of your support, all your prayers, all of your kind words. It truly, truly helps my heart and helps me. And I just jumped because a hummingbird just flew close <laughs> close to the camera oh my gosh and the hummingbird there's a story behind the hummingbird the hummingbird is his sister Kelly I can't remember if we talked about that but his sister Kelly who had passed um, wanted to be remembered as a hummingbird and I, I just had a hummingbird hummingbird visit <sighs> Oh, what a beautiful moment. Okay, with all that said, isn't that what he says all the time? I say toodaloo for now.